Hello folks, back again here with another review. This time I'm gonna reviewing Red Skull PF 14 scale statue done by Sideshow. You looking at the art color box now. This is the front side, left side with Hydra logo and map around it. This is the rear side and the right side. That's the Hydra logo again. Hail Hydra! Okay, um, enough with the box. I'm gonna show you the parts of the statue. Um, it comes with five parts. Uh, first, I'm gonna show you the base. This is the base. Very cool base. That's the environment base looks like. There's some rocks on it broken woods and a helmet and there's the broken or battle damage helmet here I think um, broken with bullet there really nice touch that I showed it for the base itself and the paint job is really nice as you can see um, the environment for the base itself is fantastic okay this is the bottom of the base looks like really cool um, I'm gonna put this here um, this is the hand that holding the gun or the pistol the detail is quite impressive um, the gloves really nice painted and sculpted and the pistol as well and one thing that I like guys is this there's a bullet inside the gun or the pistol here with the golden painted really, really nice thoughts that Sideshow did for the pistol itself um, I told you before the one I'm having here is the exclusive so it comes with two heads this is the regular head and this is the exclusive head looks like so two heads and you can see the difference really cool um, the detail is impressive as you can see here the teeth they did really nice the eyes really cool you can see the detail here, the way they painted and sculpted it. Really nice, and this is the exclusive looks like. Really nice job for this. Okay, now the last part is the body. This is the one. Okay. Now I'm gonna assemble it so you guys can see the full statue looks like. Okay, here it is. Red Skull Premium Format Statue done by Sideshow. He's measured about 21 inches tall from the base to the tip of the hat that he's wearing. Um, can't give you so many details guys for this piece um, because as you can see um, the statue itself covered with mixed media, 90% of it. Um, the jacket that he's wearing here is mixed media and Sideshow did a really nice job for it. Um, they did put some wires inside the edges here and here so you can pose it and they did some weathering as well if you see the brownish color around the edges here here and here as well that's the weathering looks like also here and around this part has this gray color um, also here and here um, I think Sideshow did it so you guys know that the jacket that Red Skull wearing 
um, it's old it's been wearing it for long time so maybe because it's his favorite jacket or something like that and they did a really nice job for it and also here and here they did some weathering every edges of the jacket here had some weathering really cool and you can see the where they sewed this jacket uh, really nice the mixed media is really really nice guys I like it and the cloth that he's wearing I have no complaint here nice and comes with the belt also here mixed media and they did a really nice job for the button here and here as well and if you see the red tiny circle here that's the Hydra logo really cool um, the boots here that he's wearing are sculpted not platter or mixed media and they did really nice job painted them um, it's glossy so it looks like mixed media or platter but they're not um, as well this the gloves that he's wearing they're not platter or mixed media um, they are purely sculpted and painted really cool um, now I'm gonna switch the head as you know this is the regular version of the statue looks like um, okay I'm gonna switch the regular to the explosive head there you go that's the exclusive version looks like really nice um, I like both heads because um, Satchu did a very nice job on them really cool um, the detail is impressive and the way they painted the heads both of them fantastic um, you can see the glossy eyes there really cool and the detail guys wow really amazing and I think this, this is the classic version of the Red Skull while the regular version is the modern uh, of Red Skull head this one okay um you don't have to buy the exclusive version for the statue i think the regular version is really nice already really cool nothing's wrong with it um both heads are fantastic um it fits with the pose as you can see here um the pose itself is really nice nothing's wrong with this okay um now i'm gonna leave you with 360. Okay. Thank you for watching this review. Um, I hope it helps for you guys that want to buy the piece. You don't have to buy the exclusive version of the statue because the regular itself is really nice piece. Um, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave it. Um, okay.
You guys have a good one and take care.